Hi guys, this is the Trailblazer in O1 Tool Steel, and uh, we're going to test it on oranges. First time I'm using this knife on fruits, food stuff. Although the grind, although the knife is pretty thick, um, but it has no problems um, slicing through the orange because it is sharp and uh, the geometry is good. Clean cutting, but what I'm most interested in is seeing how this compares to uh, L6 steel as you can see um, it is really clean cutting as I mentioned uh, fly blended on the orange Um, it's really good in cutting um, but let's see let me smell the steel smell the orange I want to see if there's any metallic um, strong metallic scent or taste left on the orange right and see the corrosion resistance of uh, O1 hmm hmm the orange is good um, let's see Uh, let me just continue to eat while you watch the video and let me enjoy this knife a little mm. 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 All right so um this knife would be a good um, uh, work knife, I would say, in the wild. Good for defense as well as um, for building. Mm. For building camp and such in the wilderness um, the only thing is that this is not a stainless steel it is carbon steel hmm. I mean it is a non stainless steel Okay, so you have to take care of it differently. Can you can't neglect it the way you neglect stainless steels? Hmm. The orange is uh, pretty good, but a bit sourish and acidic. Um, but we're not doing a review on the oranges, are we? The day hasn't come. Hmm. Hmm. So far, um, I'm smelling um, uh, 
this strong metallic smell on the O1 now but it doesn't leave uh, mm. Mm, bad orange but however I don't um, really taste much of a strong metallic uh, taste on the orange I can hardly discern mm, any metallic taste on the acidic orange after using the O1 steel on it by now L6 would have imparted a metallic taste to the orange but but the O1 um, no problem well I'm just taking my time making this video I just want to know something that's important to me um, and for some people who are concerned um, so if you think that this video is a waste of time just turn it off hmm. I see a natural patina starting to form on the blade you see this dark area here hmm now the steel has a familiar L6 smell let's uh, cut the orange skin Uh, this is the white of the, or rather, this is the white of the orange skin. I'm gonna rub it on the patina area. Not much of the black patina rubs off onto the orange skin. There is a hint of metallic smell but nowhere near the notoriety of the L6 so uh, O1 uh, is fine by me so far let's put my tongue to the steel and see how does it taste Hmm. A, there is a moderate um, metallic tang to it however nowhere as bad as the L6 so um, my initial conclusion is that uh, this knife would be suitable um, for use uh, for general use and um, including um, for food prep so if you are out in the wild in the trail taking a walk um, a day trip extended trip maybe you're camping overnight or a few days Mm, I think this knife should be able to serve you well. Um, you can even do food prep with it. And take note that I'm cutting orange, a very acidic fruit. So um, that would be a, a big test for the O1. But if you are not cutting really acidic things like meat or vegetables, there won't be such a problem. Okay. 
So if you ask me, um, O1, pretty good, really good, or quite good, okay, a range of good. I don't know what I'm talking about, but um, such things are going to be subjective to people. But um, it's quite okay, okay, to say the least. A O1. Uh, natural patina is already forming in the steel mm. and the uh, acidic juice left on the steel now is uh, darkening slightly and uh, smelling the juice I can smell the metallic smell but um, it is actually okay to the health I believe not a serious threat and you're not eating from this all the time you know um, perhaps uh, as what Kylie says it does give you some iron uh, not that bad okay when you're camping uh, so great knife definitely good for defense against wow and uh, Definitely good for building, camp, uh, for chores, um, and able to do food preparation, um, processing raw meat, um, some vegetables, no problem at all, no problem. Just remember to keep it dry or oiled, and uh, this knife, uh, this steel should serve you well. So, thank you very much for watching. If you are patient, you heard all these uh, constructive comments um, at the end. Thank you very much. See you. Bye-bye.